Hey Libra, welcome to your bonus reading for this week, WLC Weekly Love Connections. This will be for those of you who are wanting to get insights with regards to your love connections, okay? I'm doing this bonus reading because I've uh, received this uh, new deck. So let's try it out. What type of energies can we get from this spread? <clears throat> okay. To all my subscribers, thank you for stopping by. Info about my personal readings and everything else about this channel, check out the description box below. And new viewers, welcome. All right, tell us more about Libra's love connection, please. Tell us more. What do we have for Libra in love? This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter in love. Let's see. Six of Wands, King of Swords, Nine of Swords, and Four of Swords. Wow. Libra girl, Libra boy, stop thinking too much. Uh, Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Cups. Mm, what is this? Six of Cups. All right. And the hangman. And um, the two of wands. At the bottom of the deck, you have the nine of pentacles. Give me a second. Sorry about that, Libra. All right, so, wow. Okay, Libra. All right. The way I see it is for you, Libra, you have, um, you're currently doing well on your own. Um, perhaps job, you're liking it, you're loving it. Um, it could also be that you're doing some, I don't know, some spiritual work, moon rituals that you probably are doing. I see a lot of that. Uh, for some, I feel that you are doing you, yeah? The best way you know how. It could be you're enhancing your spiritual side, learning more about it. It could also be about um, your job, yeah? Practical stuff. But all in all, on that aspect, I feel that you are cool, pretty stable in there. Now, with regards to this connection, I feel that you have a lot for this person, a lot of love for this person, Libra. And um, several times, I feel that you have um, wanted to um, start a or to have a new beginning if you're not together. Um, this is you just wanting to have that sort of beginning. Yeah. So if the past hasn't been good, you probably are trying to forgive and forget. Or just forgive and not forget, right? But I'm trying to clear out um, negative energies, letting go of the negative energies so that new things can come. And when we say new things can come, I feel that somehow you kind of, um, you're wanting to have a fresh start, fresh beginning in love. Yeah. And it feels like you wanting that and you not having it is really giving you a lot of mental stress a lot of mental stress with regards to the person that you're dealing with i feel that you may be communicating right now it's more about um, clear and honest conversation clear and honest communication um, it may not be related to the romantic side of relationship but i feel that whenever you talk whenever you uh, discuss things it's more about what comes to your comes out of your mouth what comes out from their mouth, they're based on the reality of things. So what you see is what you get there. Um, they may not be doing any uh, actions in progressing this connection, yeah? Um, it's more about them just letting things be, letting things unfold, yeah? Letting things unfold naturally during this time, the way I see it. Uh, I feel that for some of you, this person may have been heartbroken too. 
whether it be with you or with their past uh, relationship or that as of the moment this person is heartbroken and still trying to heal the wounds from there it may not be from you there might be somebody else yeah that they are healing from and um, I feel that they are transitioning yeah transitioning into a better state um, with regards to you Libra I feel that You know what? I feel that this person still wants you, still wants to, um, still wants to be in contact with you, still wants to get your attention, still wants to give you attention, and this is someone who look up to you. I feel uh, someone who, yeah, who looks up to you. And if this is a masculine, um, the masculine um, energy in, in your relationship or connection, yeah? This is someone who wants to win you back. Yeah, this is someone who wants to win you back. And I feel that a con a con communication perhaps is coming if, I, if it hasn't um, happened yet. And the way I see it is there's going to be some form of reconciliation, some form of... Um, you know, perhaps even forgiveness and then softening of, you know, there's that softening of um, feelings towards one another. So if there's been bitterness in the past, that will be um, softened up and it's kind of be replaced with uh, a little bit of goodness because I do see that, I do see that, um, you will, you or the other person would be a little bit more nostalgic this time. So if this person is healing from, from their own heartbreak, yeah, as of the moment, I feel that, or even if this is with you, their heartbreak with you, I feel that they would try to win you back because they miss you so much. Yeah, they miss you so much. And the way I see it here is you may... You may be healing right now, Libra, because I feel that everything is, is quite okay on your side, quite good, quite all right. And you may be wanting to have a new beginning, a, a, you know, a, a beginning, a loving one. And perhaps you may have, for some of you, you may have let go of this person already. But the advice here I see is um, look at things from, from your, your perspective right now. The advice is to look at um, things in the situation with a new pair of eyes, yeah? Um, I see that, you know, there could be a change in perspective with regards to how you define love, how you see love, how you see relationship, yeah? Especially with your dealing with this particular person, yeah? This could be a soulmate for you too that has given you that... Um, opening to to what love is yeah at this point in time in your life for some of you this could be a catalyst of your growth i see yeah for now you would still be at least for this week the way i see it is you would still be standing on your own feet not really making a lot of uh, big decisions um but somehow at least at the end of the week, you would have um, some specific roads in your mind, you know, where to go or some options laid out for you to choose from. Yeah, that's what I see. That's what I see. Communication too. I feel that this person would reach out or you would reach out to this person. If you are communicating right now, you might feel that the communication is more um, logistic, more civil, or what needs to be talked about yeah, on a day-to-day -day basis. Nothing really um, emotional or vulnerability in there. Yeah, but it's more about 
just showing up to the world showing up to this connection whenever you need to especially if you have like common goals common responsibilities together so it's more it's more about that for now but that communication could actually lead to you knowing that um, well this person wants to win you wants to have success with you wants to um, wants you to see them with a pair of new eyes yeah because they miss you yeah and that's something for you to decide libra it's not something that is um forced but it's something for you to decide but at least i see that um in the coming few days you would have that um kind of two options to look at two options on where to go whether do you still want to proceed in this or you're heading for a new beginning yeah new beginning with yourself or with someone else that's up to you okay but i do see someone here who wants to um someone is not talking to you who will still want to win you back mm -hmm. i'm gonna leave it at that and um let me know how this resonates in the comment uh, comment section below don't forget to hit like and subscribe and um, click on that notification bell all right if this is where we part ways thank you for stopping by it's a bonus read guys